but <laughs> software vendors can kind of throw out defective software all they want sure. and not really have any liability. Like, what's your take on their role in the liability chain? Yeah, I mean, until uh, until pr- a product is regulated, you know, to a safety standard, how can there be any acceptance by the populace that it's safe? I mean, we do it with food, we do it with cars, we we do it with everything else. I think that's what we were, they were trying to do with the S-bomb, right? The whole software bill of materials. Mm-hmm. Tell me what's in this thing, right? We have ingredients. I don't have any food with me right here, but like we have an ingredients list on the back of, you know, everything that we eat. So, you know, okay, this is what's in it. Oh, I'm allergic to that. Can't eat this. Good to know. Same thing with, with, with software. <clears throat> Produce the list of what it is. Let and make sure that the buyers are fully aware. Be very transparent. What version of that software do you have in there that you're using? Because because software today is built on other software. Are you using a vulnerable version? Are you using you know an unsupported version? <clears throat> Are you sure you're actually using the right version of the thing that you think you got, or is it a you know a knockoff? 